Finally. Hello, my name is Simone and you are through to the existential hotline where your dread is our reason to be. Do you know how long I've been waiting to connect? Due to the current climate, waiting times for an advisor have been slightly higher than normal. Can I take a name? Sorry. I'm, um, I'm Sorin. Hi, Sorin. Judging by our earth view, you are currently in the Northern Hemisphere and experiencing night at the moment? That's right, yeah. So, what's keeping you awake? I, I just have all these questions, you know? Well, I'll happily help where I can. What would you like to wrestle with first? 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 Well, first, I'd like to lodge a complaint against Satan for everything that's going on. I'm sorry. I think you're actually after deity support. We don't handle complaints in those areas. Although, actually, it is worth noting that the underworld does primarily deal with sin. I'm afraid plagues are more, um, upper management's area. Oh, I see. Is there anything else I could help you with? Yeah, there is. I'd like to register my concern about a threat to people's free will. Okay, and uh, would you consider that actual threat or perceived threat? Well, I saw it on the internet. Very good. And uh, where would you say this threat lies on a scale of one to ten? One being your more sort of harmless threats, like Elvis isn't dead, flat earth societies and fake moon landings. And then ten being your hardcore stuff, like 5G billionaires, lizard people and anti-vaxxers. Uh, then I guess, uh, ten? Sorry, you're actually after the conspiracy forum. We don't handle ravings in those areas. Well, what is it you actually do then? Well, we handle the crushing, unfaltering force of humanity's inevitable crisis when grappling with the existence of itself. <sighs> Sorry, I don't think I have that. What, really? You don't worry about the fragility of life and that you're merely a grain of sand in the hourglass of time likely to get lost in the cascade? Well, now that you've phrased it like that... Our actions being both meaningful and pointless, all just trying to create some modicum of sense in a senseless world. Oh my God, you're right. How can there even be a meaning of life when every person has their own definition? The very constructs we live by are created by us. Reality is... Relative, I think I do need your help. Oh, come on. I'm sorry, that's nihilism. If you can't even answer that, then what exactly is the point of you? Exactly. For nihilism inquiries, you're going to need their dedicated helpline, so I'll just pop you through. No, 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 wait, wait. Welcome to the Nihilism Helpline. We're deconstructing your perceived perception of existence is our only reason to be. Frankly, this is all just completely unacceptable. Well, I can see you've come to the right place. Hello. Hello. Oh, yeah, that's it. Welcome. Psychotic. That's too psychotic, isn't it? How can I help you today? Can I take a name, please? Can I take a name, please? <laughs> Where your dread is our reason to be. <laughs> Booger. The existential hot line. Hello, my name's Simone, and <laughs> you're due to the existential hot line. <laughs> ah! <laughs>